Hi and welcome to our video reviews. In this episode, we introduce you to a modern classic from Audi. Although it is quite unassuming at first look, this is no ordinary station wagon. The RS4 Avant from Audi has been created as an everyday sports car. The latest Audi RS4 Avant is now in its third generation and was introduced 12 years ago. What it is, is basically a very sporty and powerful version of the Audi A4. Let's take a look at the exterior. Most of the sportiness of the RS4 Avant comes off its 20-inch titanium look alloy wheels with its 5 V-spoke design. The distinct look of this car is also enhanced by the wedge-shaped headlights which come with daytime running LEDs and the single front grille with its tapered upper corners. There is also the large air intakes at the front and the LED tail lamps. Although the RS4 has a very flashy exterior, it's what's under the hood that makes it the kind of station wagon that I would consider buying. It's powered by a 4.2 litre FSI V8 engine that produces 450 horsepower and 430 newton meters of torque. It also has a top speed electronically limited at 280 kilometers per hour and all the power and torque produced by this engine is channeled through its 7 speed S-tronic gearbox to all four wheels through Audi's legendary Quattro system. What makes the Audi RS4 an everyday sports car, in addition to its enormous amount of power on tap, is its spaciousness. And along with its roomy rear seats, it also has boot space that's comparable to what you would find in a mid-sized SUV. Let's take it for a spin. The dashboard and multimedia interface is now quite standard across the entire Audi premium range. And the RS4 Avant comes with navigation, a panoramic sunroof, rear view camera, electrically folding side mirrors, lane change assistance, in addition to standard features like cruise control and Bluetooth phone connectivity. The RS4 Avant comes fitted with a dynamic steering as an option and although it is quite a technically advanced piece of engineering, it lacks sufficient feedback, which I think is quite important for this kind of car. The electromechanical assistance, however, does improve the feedback when compared to the standard Audi A4. The RS4 does a 0 to 100 sprint in less than 5 seconds. The launch control feature enables takeoff with optimal amounts of traction and combined with the enhanced suspension that's made mostly of aluminum and its quattro system comes equipped with additional enhanced features like a self-locking, crown gear, central differential and torque vectoring. The top spec variant, like the one we're testing today, also comes with sports differential, which actually splits the torque between the front and rear axles, depending on tractional requirements. In 
terms of fuel economy, although the RS4 Avant is powered by a large V8 engine with high revving technology, its long top gear enables it to have an average fuel consumption of only 10.7 liters per 100 kilometers, which is not bad at all for a performance car. Overall, what you get with the Audi RS4 Avant is a utility car that's fitted with Audi's superior Quattro system and a very powerful engine. This brings us to the question of price, and in the Middle East, the RS4 costs $79,000, which is around 290,000 dirhams, and it goes all the way up to 320,000 dirhams for the top spec variant. The RS4 isn't conventional because it's a station wagon with superpowers, and it deviates from your usual coupes, sedans, and SUVs. And that's exactly where its appeal lies. It also has the advantage of the optional 280 km per hour top speed as compared to 250 in most of its competition. And with a price that's not too exorbitant, I would think that the RS4 could fit in perfectly as the family car for power hungry enthusiasts. Thanks for watching. We hope to bring you more over the coming weeks. Click on the link below to subscribe to our channel and visit our website motorade.net for more reviews and information. Thanks again.